Hey guys, it's me, the mayor again, and today we have one coconut water, or O period N period E, coconut water with a splash of pink guava. Guava, I don't know how to pronounce that. 16 fluid ounces, not too bad. 80 calories, 11% um, potassium, sugar 17 grams, and what do we have here? Vitamin C, 200%. Ingredients, coconut water, pink guava puree, sugar, absorbic acid, and natural flavor. So it's pretty much organic. Comes in a Tetra pack, so, you know, no metallic tastes or anything. Best honor before 12, 18, 13. Oh, I better do this pretty quick. The second. And uh, package is your standard cardboard. What is coconut water? Blah, blah, blah about coconuts. One coconut water without compromise. Gluten-free, fat and cholesterol-free. Potassium per package equals one banana and not from concentrate. Rejuvenate your body with the good stuff. All right, well, let's see if it lives up to its name. All right, well, these are the two people that brought you the beverage, Rodrigo Veloso and Eric Loden. They were from, uh, they, they were in Brazil uh, when the MBA students went ahead and made some type of uh, business plan to launch off, you know, coconut drinks. Um, then a year later, after they got it all said and done, it hit Southern California and supposedly took off. So now I think it has 30 employees and the Pepsi, oh, they have a distribution with the Pepsi uh, Corporation. So this is a Pepsi-sponsored product, you know, not made by Pepsi, but, you know, more or less sponsored by them and distributed by them. Now, if you want to find this product out there in the market, uh, Kroger's and Whole Foods is going to have it. Um, probably not anywhere else. I don't even know if Walmart will, but I know Kroger's and Whole Foods has them for sure. All right, well, it's just shake well. Shake well, shake it. All right, now open it up. Oh, it has a weird cap. Huh. Looks like teeth on a leech or something. Looks kind of complicated, kind of dangerous in a way. Oh, it looks kind of promising. Wow. This is some pretty good stuff. <clears throat> well, it's not filtered, I don't think. Or maybe it's the, uh, the pink guava. I think that's not that's probably what's not filtered. But um, let me see here. Where does it say? Yeah, guava puree. So that has like some of the plant matter still in it. Tastes pretty good though. I'll tell you what. It's got extra sugar in it. You know, added sugar. So it tastes pretty sweet. You know, it's not like the other types of coconut waters. You know, that are a hundred percent. You know, no sugar, no additive, no nothing. You know, this one's more of like a you know like a soft drink beverage type. You know, you're gonna get a little bit more punch out of it. Uh, I mean, it's pretty good, and I'm pretty sure it's a lot healthier for you than, like, a Coke or something, but I'll tell you what, it tastes great. Yeah, surprisingly, it's not too thick. You know, it has that sugar, but it doesn't make it too thick. And the uh, guava puree, it's got enough in it to definitely taste the difference. Now, the coconut water itself... Uh, it's pretty good, pretty good. Um, I've tasted a little bit better, but like I said, I mean... This is probably above most coconut waters out there. And with the extra pink guava in it, it actually creates a pretty good fruit melody. Kind of like I'm downing like a fruit juice drink, you know. And shaking it well, that probably helps stir up all that guava down there. Final thoughts, drink it on a hot day? Yeah, I would. Definitely. It's good enough for, uh, for me, so I'm pretty sure it's good enough for y'all. And me, I really don't like coconut waters too much, but... You know, I do it for y'all guys, so that way y'all guys can get some, you know, good intel on the situation. Alright guys, well, um, cons, not really much. 99 cents bought me 16 ounces, which is like, you know, two 8-ounce servings, so pretty good deal there. And it tastes great, and it's not overly sugary, surprisingly. Alright guys, well, that's the mayor. Thanks for watching.